Hey guys, this is Super Testnet, and today I wanted to show you my latest invention, which is called Swap Service. It is, as it, as it says, an order book for performing submarine swaps on Noster. Uh, it's also a yield chasing tool, so if, if you want to earn yield on your Bitcoin, you can put it in a Lightning node and run this Swap Service software, and you will sell uh, liquidity for um, Sats, which is cool. Uh, I want to show you guys how it works, and uh, in order to do that, I do want to show you how to install it. But uh, just to sh before, uh, when I tr did this before, it was really bad to show you the installation procedure before showing you what it looks like. So I'm going to show you what it looks like first, and then I'll show you how to install it. Um, so right now I'm running a copy, but the um, but there are no orders in this order book. So I'm just visiting this web page, and there's you know there's nothing in the order book. So let me just get it running right here. Uh, I just uh, Get, got it set running and instantly an order shows up in my order book and now um, I've got the, the, I've got the Alice and Bob situation here Alice is running node software she's got a lightning node and she is um, you know she's doing this part and then Bob is over here on this website he wants to buy uh, sats in the base layer uh, for sats on lightning uh, and so that's what he's gonna do so he's gonna accept this offer and let's say he wants to buy 1234 sats on the base layer, uh, and he's going to put in a Bitcoin address where he wants them to go. I'm just going to use this uh, address from a faucet. So he's going to send Bitcoin on the he's going to send Bitcoin on the base layer to this address, but he's going to pay on Lightning. So I'll just hit submit there. It says, "Are you sure this is this is going to have a you know a 272 sat fee? Is that is that okay? Some of that's going to go to the swap provider. Some of that's going to go to miners. He's going to say okay, and when he does, uh, it is going to give him a Lightning invoice." and ask him to pay that. I'm just going to use uh, htlc.me, which is a, a testnet uh, service for paying lightning invoices. And i got to reconnect to it. Uh, so, yes, I'm a human. It's going to want me to do that again because of connection issues. OK, so now I'm going to pay this lightning invoice. Yep, that looks good. I do want to pay 1,500 sats to get you know 1,234. Uh, so while it's doing that, uh, I can tell you a little bit about this service. Uh, so it's using submarine swaps, which means that you can go from the lightning layer to the base layer uh, without uh, needing to trust your counterparty. Uh, and so anyone can run this service that lets people uh, trade sats on the lightning layer for, for sats on the base layer non-custodially and uh, with trust minimization. So um, there, the transaction just went through. And in fact, this, if we examine this, uh, there are now 1,434 sats in a swap address right there. You can see 1,434 sats. And then if I wait for that to confirm, it'll be uh, trust minimized, but I'm just gonna hit okay and immediately sweep that. So now, as I, you know, I paid for 1,234 sats in to, to go into that address I picked, and there it is, 1,234 sats just went into that address I picked from the swap address. Uh, okay, so that is a basic overview of what swap service looks like. Um, there is a, an open order book that anyone can add orders to, and they can run this service that you know, takes a fee for doing swaps from the base layer to the lightning layer, and, um, and basically just sell their liquidity. Which is really cool because this is a this is a needed service for doing stuff like opening channels, balancing channels, um, managing liquidity, uh, and then doing stuff like w wallets that have uh, support for a unified interface. This is all stuff that's based on um, swaps, and and now we have a tool that anyone can use to to do swaps and earn income from it. So now that I've shown you what it looks like, I'm going to show you how to install it. So you just go to the GitHub, which there's a link under the description for, for this GitHub, uh, and then you click Instructions for Yield Chasers. That'll take you down here, where there is a Git repo for this, um, or for those instructions. So I'm going to cancel uh, running this. I'm gonna get out of this directory and remove uh, the, ex the example that I've been doing here. So remove swap service. And so now I'm starting with a clean slate. So I'm going to show you how to install it from, from nothing, like if, if you have nothing installed yet. Uh, great, let's just clone the GitHub repo for swap service. That's done. Change directories into it and uh, set it up as a Node.js app, which is, that's done. You know, that takes a couple of seconds. You will have to install NPM, but if you're a Bitcoin developer, you should, I'm sure you already have that, or you can find instructions online for installing NPM. 
Um, then we're going to install the dependencies, which are um, needed in order to make this application run. Uh, mostly some cryptography stuff, WebSocket stuff, because we're using Nostra for part of this. Um, it's sec P256K1 library and Bitcoin JS lib and a couple other things. So we got that. All the dependencies are installed now because there's not very many of them. Uh, then we have to, uh, nan we, I'm going to use the nano editor to edit a configure some configuration stuff. And I'm going to do this on testnet, so I'll use this line right here. Okay, and so this um, tool right here wants to know your invoice macaroon, your admin macaroon, and of course the, this is all running on my own local testnet, so I've just got this stuff you know, set up and ready to go, but um, you'll need to replace this information with your own nodes information, and then I've got uh, a, a local copy of uh, LND running and that's gonna it's gonna connect to that on my local host this machine of course you could change that to your machine or if you have voltage you know you can set it, set it up to work with voltage as well uh, just get your admin Mac and invoice Mac from your voltage page and uh, and then the the endpoint URL that you'll need um, is on voltage as well if you have one of those then you set a minimum amount and a maximum amount <coughs> that you're willing to do swaps for so in this case, I'm doing the bare minimum, the Bitcoin dust limit is what I'll do a swap for. And then we set a, a fee type. You can either choose percentage, in which case the five here will mean I'm taking a 5% fee, but you can of course change that to whatever you want. Or you can do an absolute fee, uh, in which case, like if I did absolute and then put five here, that would mean I get five sats um, as a flat rate per swap. Um, but I, I prefer percentage, so that's what I set it up by default. But if, you know, of course, you can change it to whatever you want. You can do fl flat fees or percentage fees or, or whatever. Um, so I've got the software set up here, uh, and, and it's ready to go. You just save it, and as it says down here, uh, run the app. Uh, and you can run it either on mainnet with nodeindex.js or on testnet. So I'm going to run it on testnet right here. And when I do that, you can probably you, you might have just seen there this new one popped up, this new offer. Uh, and so yeah, that is how you run it. Uh, and the cool thing about this, uh, now that I've shown you the installation instructions, which are super easy, you know, you can just you, you can run this thing and get a get a fee rate for the sats that you hold in your Lightning node. And other people can come to a public website and uh, find your liquidity and then buy, you know, buy sats from you and, and do swaps and such, which are, you know, this really important thing that Lightning uses all the time. Uh, you can think of this as a um, less centralized version of Lightning Loop um, or, or a version of Bolts Exchange that anyone can run. Uh, it's kind of kind of like that. Uh, or, you know, eventually I'd like to see this as the back end for Moon, Moon Wallet um, clones that have a unified balance for Bitcoin and Lightning. Um, but yeah, this is a Nostra swap service or, or just swap service and I encourage you to give it a, uh, to check it out. There will be a link in the description for how you can run it yourself and hopefully we can get a huge market for liquidity uh, on the Lightning Network. Thank you guys for checking out my project and I uh, hope you have a great day.